my wife Lauren, as well as my two baby girls, and myself, we have all tested positive for COVID-19. And I could tell you that this has been one of the most challenging and difficult things we have ever had to endure as a family. And I wish it was only me who tested positive, um, but it wasn't, it was my entire family. So this one was a real kick in the gut. But I am happy to tell you guys that we as a family are good. We are on the other end of it. We're on the other side. We are no longer contagious and we are, thank God, we are healthy. And we've gotten through COVID-19 stronger and healthier. I tell you, you know, some of the silver linings out of this, and I'm always trying to look for silver linings when challenges come my way, is um, generally uh, babies and little children um, can often have little to no symptoms at all. So for our babies, Jazzy and Tia, it was, um, they had a little sore throat uh, the first couple of days, but other than that, they bounced back and and they uh, it, it's been life as normal. Uh, happy babies running around and playing, uh, but we have isolated ourselves as a family. It's what we had to do. But Lauren and I, it was a little bit different uh, for Lauren and I. We, we had a rough go, but we got through it. And again, we got through it as a family. We are stronger, we are better, and we did it together. We picked up COVID-19 from very close family friends. And these are people who we love and trust. These are people who we still love and trust. And they are devastated, by the way, that they were the ones who picked it up. They have no idea where they picked it up. Uh, they're devastated that it, that it led to them infecting our family um, with it. Luckily, we were able to control it and mitigate it, uh, and it didn't spread out of control. Um, but they, like us, have been incredibly disciplined. We have been in quarantine for months. We wear our masks every day. Um, you know, I, this, it baffles me that some people out there, including some politicians, uh, will take this idea of wearing masks and make it a political agenda, part of a political agenda, politicizing it. It has nothing to do with politics. Wear your mask. It is a fact and it is the right thing to do. And it's the responsible thing to do, not only for yourself, but for your family and your loved ones, but also for your fellow human beings. What can we do now is we can control the controllables. Wear your mask boost your immune system, think twice about who you have over to your house, and if they are coming over to your house, get them tested. We are counting our blessings right now because we're well aware that it isn't always the case that you get on the other end of uh, COVID-19 stronger and healthier. Um, I have had some of my best friends have lost their parents, their loved ones uh, to this virus that is, that is so incredibly relentless and unforgiving, and it is insidious. We are counting our blessings, um, but we are good.